Hey y'all, welcome into the reading. I hope you guys are having a good day. So I'm going to do another sidebar LOL because I feel like that one was a little different. But I still am going to post it. So it's called Sidebar LOL Slay Activated. Real Slay Activated. Okay. Let's see what this one's about. Sidebar LOL. Thank you, Angels and Spirit Guides. Sidebar LOL. I need to write this down. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, Angels and Spirit Guys, Sidebar LOL, what is this one going to be called? <laughs> Sidebar LOL, the angels bow before him. That's what I just heard. Happy, happy. Okay, so we're, okay, we're here. Sidebar LOL, the angels bow before him. We got flexibility. We got go the distance. We got milk and honey. Damn, we got a leg up. Okay, so off top, okay, there's some miracles and some blessings, some good stuff coming in, some nourishment, some resources, okay? Some powerful energy is headed your way. There's just a need for you to be flexible about how it comes in, okay? Happy, happy, still at the bottom of the deck, okay? So, angels bow before him. Flexibility. Sidebar LOL. Angels bow before him. Show me clearly, Spirit. What are you saying? Sidebar LOL. It's like something was trying to be big in your life. Okay? It was trying to project over your life or control your life. But the divine is like anything that was trying to be bigger, bigger than, than him in your life has to bow be, before him, including the angels. So even the angels bow before the divine flexibility. Maybe God is asking you to bow before him. Surrender control to him. When you bow before someone, you're basically saying they're in power, they're in control. The angels bow before him. The angels even know that God is in control. So maybe the angels are letting you know that God is in control. We got two of swords. Flexibility. Okay, there's an energy also that wanted you um, in some hangman energy. Wanted you trapped. This energy has been blocked out. Okay, we got the four of wands. Your security, your protection is reaffirmed, reestablished. Your home is secure. The star, you're receiving the proper recognition. They're also saying you're receiving the proper birthright. We got temperance, go the distance. Your ancestors are saying patience. Here's that five of cups. Five of Cups speaks about a sadness, an emotional sadness. But with temperance here, that emotional sadness is being healed. Page of Wands, you're going to receive some sort of message. I just get a strong energy, like something was trying to, to either play God in your life, be bigger than God in your life. Or serve as some sort of obstacle and make you think that God wasn't bigger than the obstacle or the circumstance. But it's like God is proving otherwise. The chariot, okay, that's victory, that's movement, that's the slay, real slay. So that real slay energy is going to come through. Three of coins, here's that opportunity. Someone's going to want to work with you. Someone wants to tell you you've won. There's some money coming into you. You want some money? Somebody wants some money? Eight wands. Okay. Damn, milk and honey, you want this? The angels bow before him. 
There's a new beginning here, a new start or a fresh start. Okay, Hermit energy with the leg up, go within. All right, Six of Wands, yeah, you got a victory, you won. The Empress here. You won some type of resources. You won these resources. We got Hierophant. We got the Eight of Coins. This has to do with work. Maybe you've been working for God, working in your purpose. Seven of Pentacles. Okay? But there had been some sort of delays. Maybe this, this recognition, this victory was delayed. I'm hearing or tried to be delayed. Let's get one more. Leg up. Yeah, Queen of Swords. You've gotten a victory. The Queen of Swords has the head of their enemies in her hands. This is victory after the battle. Angels bow before him. God is saying he has the victory. Seven of Swords, happy, happy. Oh, Seven of Swords are liars, deceivers, tricksters. God is saying be happy, happy because angels bow before him. If the angels bow before him, you know your enemy is going to have to catch that knee. They're going to have to bow it on out. These seven of swords, these liars, deceivers, decepticon energies, they're they're about to bowing, they're bowing out. I'm hearing bowing out. God's energy is so like, oof. Yes. <laughs> Sidebar LOL. Angels bow before him. You're being seen as the star. Regeneration. Coming back to life. TikTok. Changing the wind. Damn, these are all the cards. Okay, time to go. Things are about to get moving. Come to the edge. I feel like the divine wants you to take some sort of healthy risk. Okay, put yourself out there. It's safe for you to do so. It's safe for you to put yourself out there because even the angels bow before him. This is like, if God be for you, who in the hell can be against you? The liars, the deceivers, the Decepticon energies. But you're getting the leg up out of this energy. You've gotten a victory. Spirit is saying be patient as they block out this seven of swords. The seven of swords was trying to keep you in the hangman energy. There was a liar that was trying to keep you trapped, keep you tied up, keep you bound, keep you restricted. God is saying be flexible. You're going the distance. You're leaping off into a abundant time, an abundant season. I'm hearing favorable, and I also heard admiral, admirable. God is working right now to cut out the, the, the delays or the energy that was delaying you. Sidebar, LOL, angels bow before him. I'm like, even if that, even the angels bow, be, who do the, who the ops think they are? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? If the angels bow before your God, what the ops think they're going to have to do? Submit, surrender, retreat. It's that type of vibe. <laughs> this has been your reading. I hope you guys enjoy. See you next time. Bye.